Regardless, several Ooh. violent skirmishes. Okay. That is um something I don't want to hack. I also don't want to start a fight in here, but I'm gonna steal everything from your desk drawers and stuff. Alright, that's cool. Alright, so what do we have in this one? Nothing? You guys suck! Yoink. A couple of witnesses told me they saw you throwing Molotov cocktails at the Lem Clinic bins. Nah, man. That wasn't me. I don't even know what that protest is about. Ooh, revolver ammo! I don't even have a revolver. Something about these disappearances. Yeah. One of the boys who went missing lived in my building. I used to argue a lot with my neighbor Casey. What did they argue about? The boy used to listen to that conspiracy DJ, Lazarus. He used to blast that trash out of his window so the whole city could hear. Casey was always yelling at him to turn it down. Mm -hmm. And what about that makes you think Casey is involved in his disappearance? Well, one day. I heard the boy yelling something about Casey being a government spy and that he and the CIA were working on a plan to take over the world. The next day, poof, the boy was gone. Interesting. Yeah, that is interesting. What? Excuse me, but I am telling this officer something very important. <laughs> Fine, whatever. Let's just keep going around. We do have to get to that top office and look what's up. But we also have to get to the morgue and find where that is. Okay, let's just go through the vent. Do, 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 do. Oh, seriously? What? Oh, it's so you can sneak behind there and not get spotted by all the coppers. Okay, well, the cops don't want to mess with me. We just got in from Kanat Technologies. Kanat. Oh, man, you're kidding me. They're finally going to arm us with the peps. What? That's right, my friend. The pulsed energy projection system. Single shot, non lethal. Firing a concussive blast so strong it'll knock down an elephant. Those gangers won't even know what hit. I want that. What? Time. CPD's been using those for a year already. And we got worse problems than them. All right, elevator. Take me up. We're down. I guess we're going down. All right, fine. We're going down. We're going down. Going to go see the body. I hope this doesn't like set off an alarm or something cuz that'd be annoying. Poop. Poop. Yeah, about time. You the home sec guy was ordered to wait for? Tell Manderley I didn't get the memo until I was halfway through the autopsy. Huh. By then, it was too late to close him up again. Right. So you recovered the neural hub? Tricky bit of work that was. A few inches lower and the bolt would have fried more than just the pedal connectors. As it is, I can't guarantee you'll get anything useful out of it, other than the fact that it's been modified. Modified? With what? Some kind of wet drive. But hey, I didn't look. Ultraviolet means ultraviolet. And I know how touchy you guys get when it comes to matters of national security. He's all yours. The house has been detached, but I left it in the skull as ordered. Now, if you'll excuse me, I got paperwork to fix. Okay. I'm gonna save just in case some shit goes down just because I grab it. Okay. Yoink. Boss, I got the neural hub. Looks like it's been modified with some kind of wet drive. Pritchard should have a look at it. No, don't bring it here. Frank's not finished running his diagnostic, and I don't want to risk connecting any tech to our networks till he's done. Especially if the tech is military. So what do you want me to do? Take the hub to your apartment. I'll have Frank contact you there. Okay, fine. I use my own home computer. Let me just take all this guy's stuff, hack into his computer. Do 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 do. Aw, oh, come on, damn it. Level two hacking, huh huh? I hate that shit. And what's the difference gonna be, huh? What's the difference honestly going to be? It's not going to increase the skill level required or anything. It's just going to be level 2 hacking. Meh. What do we got? Energy bar. Okay. Do, 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 do. Open all the lockers. Steal all the metal, all the supplies. Take that pistol. I'm such a dick. I just take everything. Okay. Sewers. Restricted access. Oh. Interesting. Okay. Right, well, I don't need restricted access because I got clearance from Haas. And I'm gonna go visit the upper places. And I could have gone through the elevator, but fuck the elevator. I got staircases, yo. Now the question is, how do I get up there? Is it through the lobby over here? Hmm? No. Aha! Here we go. Floor two. Okay, floor two, and then I gotta get to one of these computers, and one, what is my objective here?
Locate Captain Penn's office. All right, I gotta investigate that guy's computer to see what's up. Well, it's a good thing I just opened the front door. Nope. Damn. What about this one? Security rating two. Son of a bitch. What's up? Hey. Back away, pal. Shut the fuck up. Ah, that was easy. So, ooh, yes, there's a vent here. Ooh, supplies. Holy shit, they've got shotguns up the wall. Does this let me go into the two? Surely there's a... There's a... Pocket security in here that I could use. Huh? No? Seriously? Nothing? Bollocks. All right, well, let's get out of here then. Ah, oh, but look at all those, all that stuff that I could just take. Mm, the ammunition and weapon modifications. Whatever, I'm leaving. Nope, can't look at it. No, sir. Oh. Okay. Let's not cross the red lasers. That's a bad idea. Let's through this way though. Pretty smart having uh, lasers. We're gonna stay here Ooh. until I get some answers, kid. We're talking about some serious fucking crimes. Crimes? What are you talking about, man? My brother's. Boop. Just gonna save because I don't know where the hell I am. Yeah. Where am I? In terms of oh, I'm on level three now, motherfucker. I'm nowhere close to where I was. You want to charge it? Typical. All right. Let's try this again. On the topic. When was the last time you saw Lucky? Was he with? I told you, it was like a week ago. We was hanging with with some old friends. Old friends. <coughs> Listen, we know you both used to run with the Motor City Bangers. We know Jason is still in deep, and we know he's into something big. Yo, you got all the answers. Why are you bothering me? Okay, smart mouth. How does all trafficking grab you, huh? Does that ring a bell? Maybe the DRBs are having a chat with your brother right now. What's up? Now you've got nothing to say. I've got all day. Yo, B, I'm here to bust you out. Sup? Everyone down. Don't worry, man. I got you. Oh shit. Don't move. Wow, blind firing sucks. There, I got him. We gotta get you out. Come on. Okay, fine. You don't want to follow me, then I'm going to have to take you out. Sorry it had to be like this, B. <laughs> Alright. Load latest save. Let's go. I don't know what we're going to do. I could cross the alarm, or I could level up my security thing and turn off the alarm system, is that? Wait, maybe they threw a pocket security in here. No? <gasps> maybe I can bring this into the vent? No. No way. Okay. Um... Let's look into my stuff. Uh, hacking... Level 2... Confirm... All right, hack. Let's try this shit in a different way. Boop, boop, boop. No, 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 no. I got this. User credentials encrypted. Device unlocked. Oh yeah. Laser system inactive. That's what's up. That is what's up. Unfortunately, didn't unlock this door. That's gay. Oh, it says laser system right next to it. Okay. Right. Hmm. What if I want to get level 3 security so I can check out the security hub? Huh. Try that out, see what's going on. 
Boop. Hack. Oh my, what the fuck? This is gonna be interesting. Nope, stop right there, criminal scum. Holy tits. Wow. That was different. They almost got me there. Okay, doors. Open. Yes! Oh, there's the peps that the guy was talking about. Oh, oh yeah. And shotgun ammo because, you know what, why not? Ugh. Um. Let's drop this on the ground. Alright, so how much room does this take up? It doesn't even take all that much room. Motherfucker. Okay. Uh, what could I drop in exchange? I need to free up two of my slots, so I could drop this beer. And I could drop one of these... Oh, I can drop the whiskey. What the fuck? Get the hell out of my inventory, whiskey. There we go. And what's the info on this? Peps. Pulsed Energy Projection System, a.k.a. Peps. Use. Knock down multiple opponents at once. May zone targets falling unconscious. An experimental weapon designed recently introduced to the marketplace. The Pulse Energy Projection System is a single-shot, non-lethal firearm capable of generating an immensely powerful canonical blast wave of concussive force that will knock down enemy combatants and display small or medium weight objects in its firing range. Ooh. Sweet. That's awesome. Alright. Now that we've done that, we're gonna lock this guy into here. Here we go. <laughs> Close. Good luck getting out of there! Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, look, a mine. Who cares, though? Okay. Close this vent door, just in case. I just want to stay here and just, like, wait for that guy to wake up and see what he does. But I think if he wakes up, everyone's gonna get alerted, so I gotta be quick. Uh... What do I got? Not on in here. I could just hack these doors, since no one's really gonna be here to see me hack them. But, oh well. Uh, take all these. Let's get his computer. Hack. Oh, Jesus. This is confusing. Alright, let's go. Oh, come on. That quickly already? And... Pow! Access granted. Yeah! Alright, Captain, from the recent incident, Sarah Francis, the body of an unidentified male terrorist was delivered to you more. You are hereby advised under this corpse has been classified ultraviolet. Holy shit. Okay. Today marks the second time this year that we've been prevented from doing my job following an attack. If there exists some question about my skill level, um, my ability to be screened, or the way I run my lab, I demand it to be brought to my attention immediately. Okay. Zeke Sanders features Hispanic missing left eye because he ripped it out. Right. Manderly. Mm, Manderly. Captain, due to the present sensitive context, it is our recommendation that case TA-00514 regarding the terrorist attack on Seraph Industries be filed and closed ASAP. In our opinion, the conclusions proposed at this stage of the investigation are quite satisfactory. I have, appo I have appointed a state medical examiner to perform the autopsies on the victims. This is a critical situation, and we might try to keep the information contained as tightly as possible. I am certain you understand the public relations nightmare this incident implies, and will act promptly and accordingly. Joseph Manderley. Oh, man, Manderley. Right. I'm gonna walk out this door now. Sup. They don't even care. Alright. Well, since you don't care, I'm gonna check out this other place. Uh-oh. Oh. 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 I'm looking at you. I'm looking at you. Hi. How's it going? Are you supposed to be here, sir? I thought the station had been locked down. Shut up, you. Ooh, what is this? Credit chip? Credit chip! Yes! Hi, I have a vending machine. Your argument's irrelevant. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do
<laughs> now you can't see me. All right, hack this. Hack. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, man. Oh, God. Oh, man. Oh, God. No, sir. You do not get a chance to come over to me. Nope. Oh, Jesus. I have nine seconds. I have nine seconds. I can do this. Stop. Ha. That's what's up, bitch. Access granted. Okay. Let's see what we got going on in here. We got some pocket secretary. Media log. What do we got? Here you go. The access code to Jenny Alexander's office is 3727. Oh, wait. You know, we haven't been reading these. Or the ones that the pocket secretaries. And... Or have we? Oh, these are ebooks. Ah. Okay. Right, well, we got it. 3727. I don't know where that's going to be, but yeah. Sheriff Headquarters. <laughs> right. Ooh. I don't know why he had two sh shotgun char cartridges in his thing, but why not? All right, let's hack his computer. Ooh, boy. Oh, come on, already? I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. Access granted. Woo! What happened, Sockpile? Sir, I think I've got a lead on a, one of the people I've gotten close to is bragging about a hidden space underneath under the floor of an old ruined building deep in Derelict Row. I know you, we've discussed this before, but I strongly suggest you read this. Okay. Gang activity. Right. Okay. Ooh. There, there's a shotgun for him to use. Let's go. Hi, sup. Don't mind me. I just moved a fucking vending machine in the way. Is this guy awake yet? No. <laughs> I just realized I left beer and whiskey next to his body. So he's just like passed out next to some... <laughs> oh, I'm such a dick. Let's get out of here. I wonder if he'll remember me punching him straight in the nose. <laughs> okay. Let's look around what's going on up here we got a a printer thingy was that a printer photocopier no one's gonna care that I threw that though because why would you all right is there anything important up here besides the room that we had some security rating one fuck you security rating one I've got a vent fuck yeah Aw, oh, damn, I can't go in there. Wait, does he have a weapon on his desk? He does, he has a shotgun on his desk. Oh boy, you know how I feel about shotguns and selling them and stuff. Yes. That was pointless. Holy shit. <laughs> uh, do I really care about hacking into these rooms? Not really. However, there's could there could be some sweet swag in there, you know? Ooh, where does this go? Oh hey, this is the entrance that we went in, we found before. Oh, that's cool. The one that we didn't really want to go through. Yeah. Okay. Uh, well, let's get out of here. No, oh, that was close. Ah. <sighs> so where am I going now? I do need to go see the chick, I think, right? She's not over there. I have to retrieve- oh, I haven't finished that mission yet, actually. Oh, shit. Okay. Hmm. I better go do that, then. <laughs> eh. There we go. Okay. Sup, cops? Don't mind me, just gonna leave and- I totally didn't break into any of your top secret stuff, including your- <gasps> Captain's office. Why would I do that? You're silly. 
Eh. Where am I going? I'm going all the way around. Okay. Or am I? Come on, baby. Turn around, Hawk. This doesn't concern you. Shut up. I'm leaving. I just wanted to go this way. Because it's shorter. It's a shorter way. Boop. We got Keep out of this hand. Oh, come no close. Get lost. Back off. Fine. God, you guys are such assholes. Hey, get away, Hanser. Get lost. Here we go. So what does he want me to- Oh, here's the crossbow from earlier. Ah. Ah, I can't do I can't grab it because my inventory's full. Ah. Fuck me. Hmm. If I drop the shotgun, would I still have room? Whoops. Or would I not have room? That's that's what I was trying to say. There we go. And I don't really care about the shotgun, so I'm just gonna get straight up give it to her. Wait, is this my apartment? Oh. Huh. Okay. Well, I could just, I'm gonna go store some stuff in my apartment and then grab that shotgun and sell it. Because money! Sup? Oh god, here's, here's Reed's mother. Um. <clears throat> hi! Hey, Mrs. Reed, what's up? Have you found anything? Please, I've got to know what really happened to Megan. I've investigated all of Detective Chase's leads. You were right. Something was off with Megan's case. So, what did you find? Ugh, let's see. An officer assigned to the case was asked to get rid of a major piece of evidence. Footage from one of our IntelliCams showed fuzzy images of the attackers bringing something inside the labs. What? What were they bringing in? I don't know. But for someone higher up to want that evidence gone, it must have been important. Okay, um, the attackers seem to use excessive measures. I got my hand on a test report that confirms what was bothering Chase. The attackers use excessive measures to make bodies and equipment unidentifiable. Oh my god, Megan. What do you make of this, Adam? I don't know exactly. I guess the idea was to leave no traces, no DNA evidence that would link back to them. But it just seems a bit too convenient. Okay, witness. There were only three people who got out of the labs alive. Me and two others. One died in the hospital a few days later. The second one, a lab tech, was ready to give a detailed description of what he saw. Funny thing is, by the time the investigators got to him, he couldn't remember a thing. You sound like you don't believe that. I don't. Not from the reports I've read. I think someone got to him first. Okay, and the final one. Someone in the government, a man named Manderley, ordered that a specially appointed medical examiner perform the autopsy. He bypassed the local ME. Simply put, that's not a good sign. It sure doesn't sound good. So what you're telling me is we couldn't find anything conclusive? No, I'm sorry. But one thing's for sure. Somebody's been hard at work covering up and destroying evidence related to this case. Somebody with power who wanted to erase anything that might have made the investigation linger. Okay, and, uh, give bracelet. I'm sorry, Cassandra. I wish I had more tangible answers to give you. But I did stumble on something I think you should have. I found Megan's bracelet. I'm sure she'd want you to have it. Oh, Adam, that's very kind of you. Her grandmother gave it to her. She loved that bracelet very much. Thank you for all you did. And, um, do you, do you know exactly how Megan died? Her neck was snapped and her body was burned. What a mean thing to say. I read the reports. She didn't suffer, Cassandra. I can promise you that. Thank you, Adam. It's not much. What about the chance that she's still alive? We comfort. never really brought that up. I miss her so much. The body was burnt to a crisp, you know? Don't worry, Cassandra. This is not over. I don't know how or when, but I will get to the bottom of this. I knew I was right to trust you, Adam. But please, 
Be careful. It's strange. I thought knowing what really happened would make me feel better. But nothing will ever justify this. My daughter is gone, and I'll never get her back. I wish. I wish I could be sure she gets justice. Trust me. She will. Aw, oh, yeah. Okay. Let's go. Uh, hi. Before you ask, no. Your mirror has not been replaced, Mr. Jensen. What? Aw. But I like my mirror being replaced. Damn it. You people suck. Where are you, Jensen? I haven't gone all night. I'm in the elevator. Hello, Pritchard. I'm almost in my apartment now. Well, when you do get in there, connect the neural hub to your computer. I've created a secure tunnel, and I'll take over remotely. Secure you can tunnel? Access my personal computer. Who do you think configured your security protocols? Sup? Mr. Jensen, I fixed up your apartment real nice. That special request you asked for works like a charm. Thank you. All right. What do we got going on in here? What's that? Hello, Adam. Ooh, it's 59 degrees out here? That's cold. Uh, 60 degrees is cold to me. 60 degrees Fahrenheit is cold to me. Don't don't even get me started. Okay. Uh, shut up, TV. Ooh. Painkillers. Sweet. What else do we got? Well, we have an assault rifle. I apparently have that in my room. Advanced clock building. Uh, okay. How much ammo do I have for this? Ah, 37. Okay. And then this. Oh, God, dude. This thing looks so badass. Oh! 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 That's so cool! Hi there! See you soon, Mr. J. <laughs> oh my god, that's such an awesome weapon. Holy Jesus. That's great. That's amazing. Okay. Right. Let's just put it away. Uh let's hack into my own security. I wonder what happens if I fail my own security hacking. <laughs> Punks. Got it. Granted. Open secret stash. Ooh. Hello. Whoa. Mmm. Sweet. Okay. How do I... How do I use the secret stash, though? I wonder. If I go into my inventory... That's not my inventory. If I go into my inventory and I... Drop it... Does it get put in there? No. What the fuck, then? What the fuck is the point? Hmm. Right. Okay. Crossbow! Ho ho! Uh. Here's my broken mirror because I punched it apparently. Whoops. Right. Why do I have so many combat rifles in my apartment? Jesus. And I don't make my bed because who the fuck would do that? Ooh. Okay. Let's finally get to this mission. What's up, Pritchard? Pritchard, the hub's connected. I know. Now be quiet and let me concentrate. I need his name, Pritchard, not his entire genetic history. That's not his DNA. It's the data he was trying to steal from us before he... My God, Jensen. Your suicide hacker didn't kill himself. Duh! He obviously didn't see his brain spidered all over the floor. No, no, you don't understand. The wet drive modification in this chip, it allows someone to hack through you. It turns you quite literally into a human proxy. I figured this out so when it happened. Alone. 
Someone offsite was doing oh the gosh, actual the hacking. Oh gosh, the cutscene's lagging. Exactly. And whoever it was tried to hide his location by using multiple satellites. But I may have just traced him to here, an abandoned factory complex in Highland Park. Get me the address, Pritchard. Because if we're lucky, whoever pulled our terrorist strings might still be there. Ooh, okay. And here, in respect to your latest reminder to have your mirror placed, may I remind you that once again that the item is on back order. The situation is out of our hand, and no amount of time passing will make it around any sooner. And while on the subject, we are still unclear as to how precisely this mirror can be damaged. Perhaps you can enlighten us. Your dog, Adam, I'm so sorry. When Megan died, nobody what to do with Coover, so I took him in, but I couldn't keep him. Oh. Okay, I'm really sorry. He was a sweet dog. Aw. Okay, hello Adam, this is a quick note of him. Mm -hmm. You'll notice there's a hidey hole of sorts built into the wall. If your key is lost to damage, have a backup. Mr. Sheriff does also, but try to reach me first. The lease is for a year and it has been prepaid in full. You shouldn't receive any questions about rent. But if you do, please feel free to refer to me refer them to me. Alright, cool. Adam, it's David. Let me guess. You're sending me to Highland Park. Not just yet. Frank's figured out why the network's been compromised. There's a persistent transmission coming from Derelict Row. Street gang territory. Well, our dead friend was posing as an Antioch. Who better to hide with than the D-Row ballers? Right. I'm on my way. Okay, alright, fine. I'll go over there. Uh, uh, you know, I'm gonna take a break, though. Be right back. And, uh... Yeah. <gasps> Look at my shades close. Okay. Okay. 